best technical advice guys welcome to an all new interesting episode of gadget world for the best technical advice next gadget that we are going to introduce to you is a smartphone from the well known brand lava and that is lava iris win one well here's yet another affordable model from lava which has got almost all those interesting specifications that could meet on the moderate smartphones available in the market So guys here we have Lava Iris we want to be demonstrated well Windows phone market is actually flooding with a lot of budget specific smartphones within a price range of rupees 4000 to 6000 and here's Lava Iris Win one the first ever Windows smartphone from Lava which is being launched in the market in this affordable price range with almost all those interesting specifications that you can expect from a Windows smartphone so let's have a quick tour on the design features the essential hardware and software features. features that this lava iris win one has got to offer for us This lava iris win one for its affordable price range has got an excellent combination of hardware specifications and not just that it has got a really good camera features and also a really longer battery life. So moving on to the display and screen of this Lava Iris Win 1. Well, it comes in a 4-inch WVGA capacitor screen and it's got a screen resolution of about 480 by 800 which has got a pixel density of about 233 ppi. So from this it's pretty much understood that the screen resolution is pretty much sharp and we could get really good contrast features when it comes to the display and the screen features. especially in the bright daylight and during a dim daylight it's found that the screen renders a really good job for this lava iris win one moving on to the daylight and sunlight breathability of this lava iris win one well if you are someone who does a lot of reading on the move well this lava iris win one definitely doesn't do the job because in the settings you have to keep it to a medium setting because if you are like using a maximum readability or maximum setting for brightness then you would definitely have issues with reading especially when you are moving in a bus or when you are reading something on the terrace so it's like a high daylight does affect the readability for this display for lava iris with one but keeping the medium keeping the settings to a medium it does render a perfect job and there is nothing to be worried about when it comes to the sunlight readability of this lava iris with one so moving on to the touch experience that this lava iris win one provides well the touch experience is pretty much sharp and has really good responses as in even though it is using a capacitive touch screen the touch experience rendered is pretty much good you would understand it when you are playing games because when you are as an essential time when you need to get really fast responses so this lava iris win one is definitely going to do the great job done the next gadget that we are going to take from arkiti is a smartphone and that is as is zen 45 Well, this particular smartphone from Asus is claimed to be pretty much simple, perfect, and beautiful, and it has almost all those interesting features of a smartphone combined with all those powerful experience that can be rendered for a user for its everyday life. So let's get in detail about the specifications of this particular smartphone. Taiwan based Asus has launched as Indian footprint with the pro, with the introduction of this Zenfone series and that is Zenfone 4, Zenfone 5 and Zenfone 6. And here we have Zenfone 5 to be demonstrated in hand and let's go through all those interesting hardware and software specifications that this Zenfone 5 of this Taiwan based model has got to offer for the consumers out there. Asus has priced its Zenfone smartphones aggressively that is the Zenfone 4 and Zenfone 5 which has been priced aggressively for less than rupees 10000 so as is it's been like it's created a lot of buzz in the electronic market with its low end smartphones which has got a really low price that is a low budget smartphones and that has repeated with both this as is Zen 44 and as is Zen 45 here so this as is Zen 45 is yet another affordable model that's been launched by as is so far in the indian market so moving on to the look and feel of this as is Zen 45 well it is yet another candy bar phone from asus which has got a basic design but at the same time it is 
has got a modern look so it's like it feels pretty sturdy on hand like it has got a very sturdy design and build features and it reminds pretty much about this STC one minus design like it's in the almost all those features especially with this dual speakers towards the front it has pretty much incorporated the build designs that this HTC one minus has launched in the market that the HTC one minus has been launched in the market so towards the front of this as is Zen 4 5 obviously you're going to find this that it's got a 2 megapixel front facing camera and an LED notification panel is there and there is a huge sensor array towards the bottom and a huge 5 inch display screen is obviously found and and this as a Zenfone Sprite front facing panel and the glass casing panel is pretty much gives a glass appeal so that means it might give an insecure feeling for you while carrying this around and more about the build features of this as a Zenfone 5 well it has got a volume broker and bar button towards the right and more towards the top here we have an audio jack and more towards the bottom there is this USB port which is used for charging so that is with the rear features which gives a sturdy approach and it's not kind of a metallic feel but it gives a really sturdy feeling for you while holding this smartphone in hand the next gadget that we are going to take from our kitty is a camera from Canon and that is Canon EOS 100D well it is one of the top level DSLR cameras that's available in the market uh, that are casual photographer that carry around and not just that it has got almost all the interesting features like it is pretty much slight in weight and also it is not that bulky DSLR that's been available in the market compared to the competitor models so let's get in detail about the specifications of this particular camera from Canon Well, here we have Canon EOS 100D to be demonstrated. Well, Canon EOS 100D is the first ever smallest and lightest ASC DSLR that's been ever made in the market so far. And that's the first ever model being launched by Canon so far, which is a really lightweight build and compact design that you could ever get to see in the DSLR cameras that's available in the market. This Canon EOS 100D with its 18 megapixel sensor and also a really huge 80% of screen coverage actually helps in rendering and capturing really good images and videos in the best with its really compatible and small design feature that's been offered by Canon so far.